Mr. and Mrs. Brown, it is your claim that the defendants have your dog? Yes. Yes. They say that the dog has been with them for the last three years. They say that for a couple of months this year, you lived in part of their home that they rented to you and that you caused some damage that they have a counterclaim. So let's get to how you're all related. My father is with his mom. They're, like, dating. Your father... Is with his mom, the defendant's mom. Which defendant? I'm, That's my father. I'm the father. Do you live together? No. What is he doing here? Because he has my dog. You don't have the dog. Aaron's taking care of the dog while I'm in New York. It is my dog. Where did the dog live last month? With Aaron. Two months ago? With Aaron. Three months ago? With Aaron. Four months ago? With Aaron. A year ago? With Aaron. Okay. So, it's your dog. Yes, ma'am. How long have you been taking care of the dog? Almost four years. I'm going to start with you. How did the dog come into your custody? He asked me to take care of the dog because he had a family emergency. And during that period of time, has the dog seen a vet? Yes, ma'am. On more than one occasion? Yes, ma'am. Do you know... Stop shaking your head. You have no clue. Um, yes. You have no clue. And when you took the dog to the vet, who paid the bill? I did. And how old was the dog when you got the dog? She's going to be 11 years old now, so... She was I about, got it seven. about six. About six, six or seven. Six and seven. And how old was the dog when you got the dog? It was a pe uh, baby. She was just a little pop. And how long did the dog live with you and Miss Brown? Annie was in and out of the house when I got the pet. Because you were dating her mother? Yeah. Are her... you still? Oh, yeah, I'm still dating her. We're still together. Long time. Oh, yeah. Believe in long engagements. Oh, yeah. So, when you gave the dog to Mr. Fitzgerald to care for... Right. Was Miss Brown living in the house? No. She was living with her mother in another house. Her mother and I are divorced. We're separated at the time. She was living with her mother. It was me and Heather in the one house and the pet. Well, Heather and I had to go to New York and I left the pit with Aaron because I didn't want to travel all the way up to New York with the okay. pit. How often do you see the dog? I get no. pictures of her constantly. You I do, haven't seen her do, a little bit. You do understand that if you were ever standing in that spot and said, I want my dog back, I wouldn't give the dog to you. Oh, correct. You I understand correct. that? I am correct. I understand that. Really, the dog's Aaron's because he's the one that's been taking care of. I understand well, that. because... The dog has certain sensitivities as well. It's been in one home for four years. It's been cared for by one person for four years. And I would say to you, Mr. Scarrett, you wanted the dog back. You should have made arrangements before within a reasonable period of time. Four years is too long. It, you're correct. Four you're years correct. is too long. So I just want you to know that, that with regard to you... Right. ...you would never get this dog back in this court. Right. I understand that. Okay. You understand that? Yes. Now, you have 30 seconds to tell me, maybe a little bit more, why you think I should take this dog out of a home where it's been for four years and give you this dog. Because I found out when I was pregnant with my daughter that I had seizures, and around that time when I had gotten back with him, we were seeing the dog. The, the agreement was between them two was if once he found a place, James could have the dog back. I found out I have seizures, and I found out she was with that connection with me. James and the doctors thought it was best for me to have the dog. <laughs> Get another dog! Get another dog. But we were helping him. Get another dog. In the year 2016, how many times did you see the dog? Quite a few times. No, no, don't give me quite a few. Ten times? Um, how many times did you think we seen How many times did you see the dog? In the year 2016, how many times did you see the dog? A couple of times, more, like... Just a second. A couple is two. No, like, I'd say every chance we got... So no, I don't want to hear be... every chance you got. I want to hear days. There are 365 days in a year. And then I'm going to ask you the days. So make sure I get an appropriate answer. In 2016, how many days did you see the dog? I can't tell you. I have seizures, so I don't know. No, well, you don't have seizures, do you? Yes, I do, no, physically. You. We, we seen, you. We you don't have seizures, dog, do you? We've seen the dog for 90 days. We, for, li we lived with them for 90 days. Is what you're telling me that in 2016, you saw the dog 90 days because you lived there? Well, that's I not what you say in the answer. No, the, I was not there. That must have been when he was the, not with me. I was not there. How many days in 2016 did you see the dog? 90 days. 90 days, because you lived there in what months? February and March. 